Sup, dude and dudettes, and today I'm going to be talking about lag compensation in Call of Duty. Right. Okay, see. So lag compensation's been out throughout all the Call of Duties out so far. What it is, is they've changed the lag compensation. They've just changed the way it works. Now, what lag compensation is, if you were to fire a bullet and there was to be no lag compensation in Call of Duty, when you fire the bullet, then the computer will say, okay, you fired a bullet, but actually you pressed the button about half a second ago. So your bullet's coming out half a second late. And, uh, okay, sorry about that. And somebody else was moving. Okay, so they, the person you're shooting at is moving. Now he's moving on your screen half a second late so there's there's a full second there delay between when you fire the bullet and when it actually gets to the person but he's got lag as well so he's got half a second of lag there's one and a half seconds of lag added up there so you got one and a half seconds of delay between your bullet go leaving your gun and hitting the person you're shooting at but then the server's got to calculate which is going to take another half a second there's two seconds delay now you wouldn't think that's much no well Let's take it this way. When you're running a one bar, that is the lag compensation, or take that as the lag compensation not working. Just pretend the lag compensation isn't there. If you upload a video and then try and play a game while you're uploading a video, that would be as if you were playing without lag compensation. Th that is how it works. So it, it takes that two seconds and it calculates and it minuses off the two second delay so the the server is actually running about two or three seconds behind everyone else playing that is that is the way lag compensation works so what have they done to change it okay so you have COD 4 World of War pretty much the same lag compensation there's not much difference Black Ops they changed it up a little bit to calculate whether certain things were happening because of the new features and such in their in their new engine but Modern Warfare 2 had one of the best lag compensations in my opinion I feel I had one of the best lag compensations I had pretty much every shot I shot was pretty much a hit marker or, or not because of lag compensation actually working and hitting the people Black Ops I don't know it felt the same as World of War or similar to World of War I think they used pretty much the same lag compensation they did but Modern Warfare 3 they changed it up a lot what they did was they took the host connection and they would down the host connection every say every time someone would get a, a worse connection than them sorry not worse a, a, a worse connection than them so you have your players you have the host and three other players let's take for example now one of those players is running on a two bar whereas the other whereas the other two are running on a four bar so the host will be taken down to a two bar because there's one person running on a two bar say that person's running on a one bar it would still take the host down to a two bar but the host being on a two bar forces everyone down one bar so everyone's now running on a three bar whereas there's two people running on a two bar say there was one person running on a one bar it would down everyone's connection one so everybody that would be normally running on a four bar is now running on a three bar but say you add another person into that who's also running on a two bar it takes everyone down a connection again and then people get connection miss connections m mess up and they and they interconnect with each other so you you have one person running on a four bar which is not the host and everyone else is running on a on a two bar that's sort of how it works it's not exactly how it works but it, it's kind of the idea that they were going for breaking the connect well it's not the idea that they were going for but it's what happened the idea that they were going for is everyone gets an even playing field so when there's one person running on two bar the host connection would be sort of given to that person so that everyone would be taken down a connection so if there's one person running on a three bar everyone else is on a four bar it would break everyone down one connection to a three bar so then everyone's running on a three bar but that's not how it worked at all
In fact, it all went really, 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 really badly wrong. So, yeah. And second to that, I will be talking about patching. Infinity Ward are the worst patching company ever. They cannot support their games at all. They don't know how to fix things. Take the shotguns, for example, right? Okay, they can, they can increase the power of things, fair enough. Good for you, you can increase the power of things. You increase the power of the shotguns, made them a little more usable. That is guaranteed. But you don't know how to take things down power, you know? You don't realize... FMG9s, for example. They haven't patched the FMG9s, there's nothing changed about them. They're still monsters. People just thought, oh, they patched them, so I'm not going to use them anymore. I'm going to go something else that's also worth a lot. But they haven't actually patched them. You can still use the FMG9s and they're still monsters. You know, there's, there's nothing, there's no difference. Uh, I don't see any difference. I played it loads and there's no difference to me whatsoever. Uh, you can see in this game I'm using FMG9s. Now, I, I, I use the FMG9s. Uh, I don't see why I shouldn't use them. You know, I don't care. You call them overpowered. I mean, look at this. This is showing how much of a monster they really are. Just watch this now. Boom. Kill that guy. Right? That was nice and quick. He didn't stand a chance. This guy didn't stand a chance. And if this guy had caught me before I started reloading, then I would have still killed him too. And I would have got a triple kill. Except I played a little bit stupid and I did. I tried to reload when I could hear footsteps around me. So, it's more about playing smart than it is anything. I mean, you know, double kill! Anyway, you gotta, you gotta play smart, and, you know, you can't really play smart when you've been taken down a peg because some company decides to give you lag because the host has lag. It's a ridiculous system, and they should really go back to one of the older systems of lag compensation. Just make it a little bit better. So I hope you've enjoyed this commentary. This has been Froggy2K9. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. P90 is a monster. Happy days.